Hi everybody, it's Derek Glassberg from Harper's Bazaar. This is Backseat with Bazaar, and I'm with Joanna Hillman and Sam Brokema, and we're talking to you about our first few days of New York Fashion Week. We've just left Alexander Wang, and it turned into a rainstorm. Yes, of course, our luck. You never know what you're going to get during Fashion Week, which explained that finale at the Alexander Wang show. Amazing. That was incredible. Who knew that black lights were going to be chic again? Basically, at the end of the show, there was about a dozen blonde-haired, white-dress-wearing models came out, whites went off, and it was time for some glow in the dark. They look like modern gladiators coming out, and they're black and white, very monochromatic. We did the yeah. best boot for spring, which was basically like a naked boot. Like, it was like more skin than leather, but still all the way to the knee. Right. And he also did those incredible helmets. It looked like you could almost bring it over your eyes. Wait, so is Alexander Wang bringing back all of my favorite things from the 90s? Including <laughs> visors? Bring back your black helmet Black lights? Visor. Oh, thank God I didn't get rid of any of that stuff. I don't know if you can do the gladiator boot, but... I'm going to give it a shot. <laughs> so what do you call the thing that he put on the um, part? Oh, is that electrical tape? I yeah, I wonder where the inspiration came from. And Look, was that tribal or was that rave? Was it a tribal rave? Who knows? Raving maybe, is back. Raving maybe is back. It is an inkling to what's coming later for the after party. Oh. Right? There could be glow sticks, I'm just saying. Yeah. When Justin <laughs> Thoreau walked in to Alexander Wang, there was a collective sigh of, where's Jenny? He was had his legs crossed very seductively. seductively. Was he was he eyeing well, he was you with, with his he was, he seductive not, legs? I mean, I'm not, let's not start any rumors <laughs> for Jennifer Aniston. But, I know, new, new but he was days. flying solo. Flo, flying solo. <laughs> He was Han who? Solo. He was Han Solo. How did Han Solo was at Alexander Way. So what else did we see in the, in the first few days? Um, Rag and Bone, which was also great and very sporty and lots of color and fun. I actually really liked Peter Salm. I always think that it's yeah. very pretty. It does pretty um, prints always. What I thought was interesting was this amazing netting over all the faces at Peter Salm again yeah. and at Jason Wu. Hey, that's a guaranteed hangover cure, isn't it? <laughs> Kate Bosworth is always fun to see. She's gorgeous. And she was up to Joseph Altazar. Oh, yes. Yeah. She, yeah, she's a fashion girl. I feel like she's very ladylike, but still has an edge. We've also had like a return of the big girls, like Liberty Ross. Like, very interesting timing walking at right. Alexander Wang. Liberty sure. Ross, we all know, is the wife of the director who had the affair with Kristen Stewart. Just exactly. to feel like if anyone's watching and hasn't read the Us Weekly's, now you know. Catherine McNeil looks so fresh right was, now. Like, did you see her, like, at Helmet Lang? She has, like, this chop with like sort of like a beachy wave thing and then Carolyn Murphy opening Jason Wu as well. Totally. Carly Kloss is back who you all know I love so much. That confidence sort of like panther stroll. Yeah, like she thing. definitely has her like sachet like her you know own individual. I taught her that. Did you? <laughs> she got really? that from me. What do you call it? She got that from me. That's just how I walk. There must True. be a name. You do glide. Well it's called the, it's called the Blasberg Swish. <laughs> So Joanna, tomorrow you'll be in a lace face mask. Yeah, of obviously, course. Yes. of course. I might have a jeweled one. It catches the light. <laughs> <laughs>